today's list. We gotta get those beans in before it rains. We're closing down on the time we can get them in. And when we find the time, we need to go uh, tear up the hay field again because there's way too many stones. And I cannot get them up with the hay in the ground. We also have uh, about four pigs now, which we have to go get some pig food later today. But with, le with that being said, let's go ahead and start planting. Maybe. A little bit of confusion, but it should be working. It's a decent day. A little chilly. Rain's coming in. We had uh, some frost the other morning. Shocked me. I thought we were done with that, but guess not. Once we get everything situated with the haze in the ground, we probably will have to go mow the other field here soon. I think that's getting growing big. Growing big, get yeah, it's getting uh, ready to be harvested. Let's put it that way. But I'm down to my last two fields that I have to plant. Luckily, this one is not as big, and that one ain't as big either. You can see the water's flowing for sure, though. Oh, that sucks. Here comes the rain. Go ahead and get this parked up for the day. We probably go work on getting some feed home. Park it up close to home. Uh, probably we'll take the trailer because we got four big bags. I don't think I can fit all of those in the Chevy. Neck now, we'll go ahead and get on the road. We will take the back road first, so I can show you what we gotta do to this field. The truck's getting a little dirty, so that field down there, the hay's coming in nice, but we gotta tear it up because there's tons of rocks in there. And I had rented out a rock picker, and it was not picking them up because they've been worked down into the soil. You can see them, you just can't get them for the rock picker, which is strange. But I've came to the conclusion that I gotta rip it up again, pick the rocks out, and replant it. So that field should be ready to go by uh, fall. <sighs> that won't be a bad field. But we got enough land for us right now. Two hay fields, two corn fields, two soybean fields. And from the looks of it, I don't think we'll probably get any more uh, beans into the ground today. Which sucks, because we are, we are getting down close to the deadline of being able to get these into the ground. Oh, it's still raining, but we made it back home now. We'll get this pig food unloaded, and then go in for some lunch, and hopefully by then we can maybe get into the Massey to do some tillage work. Hopefully. For now, I'll get these straps off, 
One, two, roll them up. Toss them in the toolbox. That side's locked. Let's try this side. There we go. Put them in there. Let's get the skid steel going. Been looking at a bobcat. For now, this is what we have. Fire's right up and it's always ready to go. It's just it's a little... A little light for it. We need to be doing. Yeah, we're definitely going to try to get a bobcat. This is uh, putting it to its limits right now. But we'll go ahead and put this over the. Uh, hole here and it'll start filling up an automatic feeder system that we have. Came with the property which was really nice. Put two in and that should last them a good bit. Get the other one. I'll probably spin the truck around since these are so heavy. Ooh, don't tip it. There we go. Okay, well that's not so bad. Oh, and the rain stopped. So after we get some lunch, we will get to tillage. And another one's done. You know, luckily we have enough seed that we don't have to worry about uh, getting gra hay seed again. Sucks that we have to do it because we could have probably used that hay seed somewhere else or for next year. And I mean, it's already been a waste of time since we took the time to plant said field, but who knows? So I'll cultivate it, probably roll it, or pick the rocks out. For now we'll get these these unloaded. I'm liking these big bags. They're actually really easy to handle. Put them over here. There's one. I think the goal might be to not have to rely on store-bought food. There it goes. But, depending on how much it costs and how well pigs are doing, we might just not worry about it and use soybeans as another profit. Alright, let's go around and get this one put away too, and then we'll put the skid steel and get the truck, and no. See y'all when uh, we're doing tillage, I guess. get some uh, tillage done should uh, it won't be entirely dry but should be good enough I, I like this Massey Ferguson it's a nice tractor nice medium-sized tractor I like this disc too. It seems to be a bit big, but then it isn't. It's perfect size. It just feels a little awkward going down the road with it. That's all.
That shouldn't be a bad field to tear up. It just sucks that we, uh, that we already had it planted, but that was my mistake, and so I guess that's the consequences of my actions. Even though, uh, don't really, it does matter because it's fine, it will be, uh, financial thing on the farm. But, with less being said, let's go ahead and get to tilling. The field has been torn up, and you can see how many rocks are there. Oh, there's way too many. I don't know why and how I got that planted. But, uh, with that being done, I'm gonna head home, call it a day. Be back out tomorrow to do some planting. I hope y'all enjoyed, and I'll see y'all in the next one.